quick little composition video here. So I start with my largest object first and I don't want it to be dead in the center because that would just be a little boring visually. So I moved it off to the side and now I'm going to place my other objects along a curve that move to the top right corner of the page. So obviously I'm working with a horizontal composition here and you can follow the same rules with the vertical composition. You want that space around your object so that way the eye, your audience's eye, knows where to look at and where to go next. So we don't want to create an obvious track, but by tilting your objects and placing them in certain ways, it adds more interest and that space around your objects, that empty space kind of in the middle of my page, really allows this focus to happen so we know where to look. Right here, I'm just tweaking and deciding where I want my, my objects to be, what looks a little busy or what's overlapping a little awkwardly. So you might have to remove some objects or make some additions. So you have to be the judge of that. Um, there might be something that you like, but it doesn't really fit in your composition. It might be too busy if you add it or try overlapping it so it doesn't take up as much space but you definitely want that white negative space around your overall composition to add breath and air so that way the viewer knows where to look. Hope this helps everybody.